Well, a remarkable discovery in Lake Berryessa turned reunion all the way in Alabama. Yeah. A class ring spent five decades at the bottom of the lake after a Fairfield high schooler lost it. A Vacaville couple just found it, and as Corey Pippin reports, they stopped at nothing to find who it belonged to and return it. First thing I'll do is probably try and try it on. See if it still fits. It's been 53 years since Dana Scott Laughlin lived in Northern California. Since then, she's married, had six children, and moved to Foley. But she vividly remembers the day in 1969, a graduation celebration, when her high school class ring slipped off her hand while swimming with friends in Lake Berryessa. We couldn't find it. I probably did cry because I was pretty well upset because I'd only had it like. A month. <laughs> Shortly after, Laughlin says her military father went to Vietnam and she moved away from her friends, never to see her ring again, at least not until last week. That's where Dirk and Kelly Biasi come in. It's got to be a million to one. Yeah. Dirk says he was fishing in the same area Laughlin was swimming five decades ago when he made the discovery. The lake was low. I walked around the bank looking for fishing weights and fishing gear. And lo and behold, I slip over a rock, and there it was. Kelly posted photos of the ring on social media, and with help from the community, identified Dana's engraved initials and found her real name. She then messaged Dana's sons on Facebook. I was so excited. She's a sweet lady. I talked to her on the phone, and she seemed really excited. I'm just excited for her to get it back to her. I just said I was so grateful, and I couldn't believe that she'd found that ring after so many years. I mean, I guess it was meant to be. That's just amazing. We're told Truly. the ring is in near perfect condition. The couple sent the ring through the UPS, and Laughlin expects it to arrive in Alabama any day now. It's on its way. What are the chances? <laughs>